Notion power users will spend a hundred plus hours configuring a tool that's indistinguishable from an out of the box calendar or note taking app so that they can schedule calendar blocks for daily meditation and reading. Your productivity system is just procrastination wrapped in Tiago Forte. I like Notion for the benefits it offers, but the evangelism of tools is so strange to me. Y'all gotta get to work. I'm gonna slow clap for this random Reddit comment here. That was very slow. Regardless, I completely agree. And I've tried to say this in other videos as well but I don't think I found a more succinct put together phrasing of the situation. I love Notion. I'm a huge user of the tool. If there was such thing as like an hour counter or like a page counter or whatever it is inside of Notion, you'd find, I don't know, I can't find it, but if anyone's ever played video games where it showcases your time played, I wish it could just track my building time inside of Notion because Lord knows I have spent hundreds of hours building stuff inside of Notion. And this isn't for everybody. And I think it's important to note that if you're just spending time building inside of Notion instead of actually working on something, you're not working. There are plenty of tools that may work for you, like ClickUp. Even just the baseline templates that are within Notion, you don't need to make your own. Now, while I recommend you adjust and tweak properties and whatnot to your own, if you're somebody who is finding it difficult to literally get work done because you're spending so much time tweaking your Notion workspace, it might be time to take that Reddit user's opinion a little bit more seriously. How are you doing at work? Do you find yourself more productive than you were prior to using Notion? If the answer to that is no, and you find yourself spending hours and hours and hours a week improving your system, that could have just been a purchased ClickUp Pro plan and some basic templates, or even just the free ClickUp plan. Maybe it's time to reconsider the basics. It's okay to keep track of everything. I'm not one to advocate against that. And I think it's much better done digitally than physically due to how these databases have great storing and searchability features. However, if you're struggling to sit down and work on your do list because you're too busy twiddling with systems and notion that don't eventually lead to a higher leveraged set of productivity. Maybe just stick to Google Calendar and Todoist or if you're an Apple user, just use Calendar and Reminders. I don't think anyone would blame you for that. I'm somebody who has spent much too much time building these things. However, it is my job to make videos about it and I make money selling templates and just being an overall productivity expert is the very essence as to how I make business selling services on creating content or these different tools. If you're not in that boat and you're just spending a lot of time building your Notion workspace, you're not being that productive. I hate to break it to you, but uh, I know I made a video on time blocking in Notion, but for all intents and purposes, that was to give people who wanted to learn how to do it an option, but I don't know if I'd recommend it. To the people who are already looking for it, they're gonna end up spending time on it regardless, so I hope that it gave you a quick way to build it, but maybe just uh, time block using a calendar app. Maybe just use a to-do list app as a to-do list. It's all in what you really want out of these tools. If you wanna spend a bunch of time building because it's fun to you, I would recommend the moral of this video, which is spend more time working than building these systems out. If you wanna set aside five to 10 hours a week outside of normal working hours or school study hours to build this stuff for fun, that's totally healthy and there's nothing wrong with it. However, if you find yourself <laughs> struggling to get your work done because you just feel like there's too much going on and you're trying to build this out in Notion, you're trying to build your perfect system, use out-of-the-box solutions and build the framework of what you wanna create outside of normal working hours so you make sure you're productive and get your work done. If I wanna use Notion building as a fun habit, I'm not gonna say it's a bad thing, but ladies and gentlemen, we gotta, we gotta stop this procrastination wrapped in Tiago Forte. Shout out Tiago, great book, how to build a second brain. But also you managed to make a lot of people nerd out about products that end up making them less productive. Not blaming you, just a byproduct of how content on the internet works. That being said, thanks for watching. And if you wanna see a video on how to actually be productive, check out this one right here.